Welcome to the Power Systems Experience Center. Here at the Experience Center, our engineers provide a safe, controlled environment for the testing, training, and demonstrating of full-scale power system problems and solutions. In this video, we will discuss the low voltage and medium voltage power distribution equipment that we have here at the Experience Center. We will show you a typical power system and how power flows from the incoming utility service to the loads. Power distribution systems contain all the electrical equipment you need to safely connect the source of power to a load. These systems are scaled according to the size, type, and number of loads that are connected in the system. Behind me is the utility pole that connects our building to the city's electrical grid. This facility is fed from a 12,470 volt distribution feeder to a 750 kVA oil-filled transformer. The transformer steps the voltage down to 480 volts for distribution inside the facility. Here inside the building, the 480 volts is connected to a main breaker, where it's then distributed to various loads inside the building, like HVAC and office space, and a 600 amp feeder that supplies the Experience Center. Here in the Experience Center, the 600 amp feeder runs in conduit to the 550 kVA isolation transformer. An isolation transformer is typically a one to one ratio transformer. In this case, 480 volts to 480 volts. Isolation transformers can be used for many purposes. We're using this one to limit the electrical interaction of our demonstrations with the rest of the building and to establish a new grounding system for our high resistance grounding unit. From the isolation transformer, we feed this switchboard we call the main IFS. This switchboard contains different types of mold decay circuit breakers that are used to distribute power throughout the experience center. An Eaton Integrated Facility System, or IFS, is a special switchboard that combines in a single structure many different electrical components that are usually separate. The 800 amp main IFS for the Power Systems Experience Center contains surge protection, meters, and touchscreen control to provide protection and flexibility. In other applications, an IFS may contain transformers, building automation equipment, or panel boards. This saves valuable floor space and improves the installation since it is factory tested as a complete system. From the main IFS, power is distributed via conductors in conduit to sections of busway. This 400 amp busway is connected to the rest of the system via the termination section at this end. The rest of the busway is mostly made up of special copper bus bars called sandwich bus. This is because they're dipped in epoxy insulation and sandwiched directly together to form a three-phase power distribution channel. Busway is very popular as a flexible option for industrial plants where equipment is frequently relocated. At two-foot increments, bus plugs are used to connect the local loads like these three safety switches. The bus plugs provide a breaker for protection and allow easy reconfiguration if a piece of equipment is moved to another part of the facility. Busway is also an efficient way to distribute power in large commercial buildings. Vertical sections of busway run the height of the building to easily power each floor. For example, the Burj Khalifa literally has miles of Eaton busway running through the building. From the busway, we power several different loads, such as our switchgear demo. For larger power systems, low voltage switchgear is used to distribute power from the main incoming service to large loads and other distribution panels. These units are designed completely to customer specifications and can reach impacities of 5,000 amps. Switchgear like this through the door low voltage assembly contain draw out power breakers, which can be removed by trained personnel while the gear is still energized. With proper maintenance, these breakers can last dozens of years. This assembly also includes PLC controls, communication equipment, and measuring devices such as relays and meters. Finally, we arrive at a panel board. Panel boards are industrial versions of the load center that you have at your house. These are the most common piece of power distribution equipment, and from here, they offer the first level of overcurrent protection. This is where loads like lights, outlets, and other common loads get their power. For very large systems, medium voltage assemblies are used to distribute power. These systems are rated from 2.4 to 38 kV. The benefit of using higher voltage is that the current is much lower for the distribution of large bulk power. This is an example of a 15,000 volt breaker that you might find at a large hospital or chemical plant. 
This 1200 amp breaker alone has the capacity to feed well over 10,000 homes. Every electrical system from your home to a factory and even the utility company need the proper equipment to safely distribute power. Eaton Corporation is a designer, manufacturer, and distributor of products and services for the largest and smallest systems. Here at Eaton's Power Systems Experience Center, our engineers are always ready to help troubleshoot, brainstorm, and work with you to determine the right solution for your system. Contact us or your local Eaton representative to schedule a visit today.